Today I will show you how to get the shaders in uh, car dealership tycoon. Enjoy the video. Okay, when you join the game, then pick your dealership and wait. It has new font, like the text thingy, like this wasn't like that, and this is new too. Like, swear to God, th this look different. <laughs> Holy cow, uh, anyways, then you need to have one dealership to work. If you have the monster gem dealership, you just need to have it. You don't need to finish it or so, you just need to have it. Then spawn it, like yes, this is the monster gem dealership. It was possible to get in the Halloween event what was like six months ago or something, I don't really remember. And yes, there was an event and you were able to get this. And it comes with this little box or like this thing and just spawn a car. I'm using this car but it doesn't really matter what car you are using. You can use this car, 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 this car. like just any car and then just spawn the car like you would normally do and go into this box and now here appeared like photo button now you don't have to click this it makes the distance blurry you can put this on but your choice i mean you don't have to but you you should put this on i mean if you just want to play you don't have to but like it hides the other players then you can put some like like modes on like cinematic or pop or something i don't know i will go with pop and this is if you aren't in a car and now you can just drive out i will uh, turn this off for now and what do you want to do now you have like this like a dumb thing here what like shows you like the things what you can do but if you have block strap you can like google it or something to like find a tutorial how to install it if you don't have i think it's only for pc i don't know maybe you can use it on mobile too but i don't know so if you have it and you have like one thing enabled, then click shift plus control plus C. And now it hide it like that thing. And if you click again, shift plus control plus G, then it hides the Roblox UI. And now I think it looks a lot cleaner. You can hide like that stuff too like with no like i don't know what which oh with b yes and now like it's a lot cleaner you can like re-enable it and if you don't like this you can like turn this off but i will keep it for now and yes this is how to do it it's pretty easy pretty cool let me get the pick for the thumbnail okay now let's come out and let's like be on this beautiful and let's get a beautiful pick I like I don't know like I like this okay and yes I will use it for a thumbnail maybe I will wait for a day maybe 10 it's better can I get oh I but it hides like the other UI but still you can like use it you can just enable it yes it's pretty cool and if you want to know how to you how to get free cam then click the video on screen it's pretty cool and if you use the shaders with it it's just perfect so click it it's cool okay bye